Hello everyone, King Bullard here with Life is Strange. Now I know this is an older game and Life is Strange 2 is coming out, but that's the whole reason why I'm going to start recording number one is to be able to get into Life is Strange 2 and have a full series of it all. Um, so this is actually my first time playing it myself. Uh, I've watched every or I've watched people play it and I relatively know what happens I don't remember it all but we'll just jump right in Life is Strange is a story based game that features player choice the consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past present and future choose wisely now I might chop this up it, it will really depend on how long it takes me to complete a chapter um, I could be anywhere from one chapter a day to like a half a chapter a day. We'll see what happens. She can talk without moving her lips. Ventriloquism. really looking forward to Life is Strange too. Like I said, I, I know relatively what goes on in one, and Life is Strange 2 looks awesome, and I, I like the storyline of this first one, hence my playing it prior to playing number two. It's a crazy tornado. That was so surreal. That might hurt. Little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography as he likely was. Okay. He's in class. Everything's cool. I'm okay. The shadow. From color to cure skin. Now. Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition of life? I didn't fall asleep, and I could sure didn't feel like a dream. Weird. Hey, Aunt Argos. There you go. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Um, I mean, better than some of the photography that I would do. She saw him in his torture, right? I can't believe I still have his pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. So, I like it in this Not that I'm going to bad, but still good. And any one of you could be that to me. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Shame, shame. I'm not reading all that. That's. Wow. A lot there. I believe Max is taking what we kids call him second. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Max is a Oh boy. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation is not the first to use images for selfie expression. So, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. It's a long time. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest in clearly one the conversation, can you please 
Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portions. Um, uh, you're asking me? You're asking me? Well, let me think. Mm. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis de Guerre was a French trainer who created the Garyotypes. The process of the portraits is sharp with like a style like a mirror. Now you're totally set as a savage. That's slapper. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s on. The first, first American Daguerreotype self portrait was done by Robert Cormier. Look at this class. Okay, I already did that. I have a feeling this teacher does everybody would like but also hate being in their class. Alright, oh, hi. Hi, Kate. Look. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. That's dangerous. I hear that. Wanna go look at a little tea? I'd love to do that. Today, I have to do a little bit. No one else. Let's hang in. Sure. Let's go there. Sure. Your porn video? Excuse me, Mr. Jeffs, can I talk to you? Yes, excuse me. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of the photographies future stars avoid handing it. Uh, do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big of a deal. Max, you're the better photographer than all. I know it's a dragon, you're some old dude like shit. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah blah blah, right? No. But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images. To frame the world only the way you envision. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift. That's a... It's hard to do, though, to be fair. Alright, let's go. Thanks. Never got what the whole foot against the wall does, to be fair. I mean, it, it doesn't do that much. It's not really good support. I mean, I guess it can be comfortable. Life is strange, as always. Well, not all people want to. Such nice music. Uh, date missing, April 22nd, 2013. 19 years old. 110 pounds, blonde, hazel eyes. Uh, okay. She's been missing for a little while then. Alright, let's just get to the bathroom. What's this? Nothing? Okay. Enter.
splash 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 gotta find some cash just relax stop torturing yourself you have the gift I mean, that's not that bad of a picture, to be honest. And you ripped it up. Let me just walk up to it. It's not gonna fly away. Nobody ever checks all the way down. Watch your language. It's not real. I wish I could reverse time. That'd be pretty cool. Let's just take a selfie. Because of our images of hopeless places, he's gonna take my selfie. Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for me. Mm. Selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Mm. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. Can you? Your generation. So I can remember. Are you sure? I wish I could. Okay. Uh, I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. Maybe excuse. Let's try this. But you're not gonna get away with this. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody in the ship? Jefferson needs to keep me in the class. And I need time to save that girl. Across the city, we're going to shout without a sound. Yeah. I'm going to look forward to something. Suckers. I hate Victoria. She's like that wannabe impress everybody. 
Oh, I can rewind faster? Okay, cool. Relax. Since you are. The Dagarian process. Invented by a French painter named Luis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, man. Hey, thanks. The Dagarian process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave such as clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading these sound chapters. Max is so far away from my bed. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be fedded by the art world. It's very exposure. I can't and skip this apparently. So Stella and Melissa do it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see. Max, you're not crazy. You're not doing it. It's time to be an everyday hero. Alright, let, let's go talk to Kate again. Yes, I do. Are you okay? You okay? So do you. Hey, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just driven. Too much stress. I know the feeling. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. She's got some serious freckles. Max, I mean. Excuse me. No. Yes. No. Excuse me. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I never let my photographer. Okay. I'm not Just. Something like that. Exactly. Max. Don't wait too long. John said that life is what happens when busy It's a good quote. Go on. Why did I have to rewind? You know, I'm not even going to talk to him. I guess I got to talk to him. I've never let one of them talk to I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire. Hey, thanks. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith. By today? Jeez. Such a critic. Make me have to do stuff. I hope I have enough time to go to the bathroom. Please, please, I can't tell anybody. Crazy. You are kind of crazy. Okay, Max, we trace every step. I washed my face, I shredded my arm, then my butterfly fell in a dark corner. It all starts there. I mean, why didn't you just do that in the first place? If you think about it. It seems like that kind of guy would always have a crappy day. It's completely real. Language. Jeez. Oh, we're gonna freak out. Do a long trip to me? Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? 
Detective Douche. Thank you, Mr. Madison. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Coffee alone and please turn off that alarm so fresh. Dude takes the job way too seriously for being a rent a cop. Um, I guess I don't know. Are you okay? I'm just a little worried about my future. You're slaying Is that all you're thinking about? Sort of. You can always be a fuck with you, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Alright, I'll stay. I just saw Nathan Prescott with a gun around. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. Yes. I was hiding behind the saw. I have the right to be there. It's the proof for me. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Don't mind my cat in the background. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. She's in heat. She don't mind. So what happened next? Then I saw him run out the door and what to do. Dust him. Yeah, no, won't do anything. That's all principles. Let's be fair. What kind of name for a school is Blackwell Academy, though? I mean, it doesn't sound like a place I'd want to go, personally. Hi. Can I can I talk to you? Can I do speak? Hi. Hey. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, alright. You look relaxed as usual, Raven. It's a school one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the world that school. Not the most. He's unstable. Not waving a gun around. What the hell is the vortex spot anyway? Seems so least. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night. Then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with the vortex book? That sounds like the setup to a horrible crime. It really does. Relax, paranoid girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel and her posters. You're hot. Rachel used to hang out in the stew. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy you are. Mm. So, you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked the party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, she was hot. Of course. What happened to her? What do you think happened to her? Whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace? Hey, Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jazz type. Victoria is. I think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel. Maybe she didn't have like it. Mm-hmm. Sure. Rachel was actually a member of the Russian school? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. 
I'll deny I ever said that. I'm more confused than before. It's such a mystery. Let's talk later, maybe. That it is, Max. Now, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out of that. Who's Dana? Alright. Let's go. I don't know where I'm going, but let's go. I can sit at the fountain, don't really want to. This is a great image. All the dripping in the corner. Uh Okay, so I gotta go okay, to the Alright, where's the dorms? Parking, swimming pool. Probably over this way, maybe? That's a creepy dude. Okay, uh, that's cool. Parking. Main building dormitories. There we go. This way. Yeah, bro. That's terrible. Hi. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you? How are you? I'm doing. I'm fantastic. I'm glad I saw Freddy and Chicklet. Freddy's gonna leave on with the party at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off being a Yeah, I would, I would say so. Now, if you'll excuse me. Sorry. I really have to find out what happens. Are you sure? Okay. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield. The selfie hello black one. <laughs> what a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wake up solution. I mean, people you like hipsters. Processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got me next one. I really hate her. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the door. We ain't here. Oh wait, hold up close. So good to know. Don't worry, Max. I'll put it in the show comment if I can reference it all over social media. No. Why don't you go fuck yourself in? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Definitely. Is that a squirrel? That's a squirrel. Hi, squirrel. Make art, not war. I just stepped on a squirrel. Oh, hi. Hey, Kate. Can't talk to you. Can't do anything. All right. Is there more to do in there? I don't know. I don't remember. Oh. Oh. Okay. How do I? None shall pass. The beach? How do I knock that over? I mean, obviously, got to do something with the paint here, but how?
Okay, I I got it. I gotta do something with the paint, but what do I gotta do? Oopsie. And then maybe let's try rewinding more. Should have just let me in in the first place, huh? Hi, Victoria. Hey, what do you want, Max? I'm making fun of you. Don't, don't say a word, Max. Hey, wait, hold that pose. And no fault of me before I post this. Now please me. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to move. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. I ain't taking it back. Mm -mm. I am not taking that back. She just learned not to mess with me. Let's just get to my room. Keep calm and carrying. Okay. Oh, I got a teddy bear. Oh, I can lay down. Let's lay down for a second. We've had a long day. Just. It's our birthday. Okay. Of course. It's always tall tales. Yeah. Truly. Where's that flash drive? <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she said. The longer I wait, you are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mom. Drink up. Jeez. Can't even water your own plant. Alright, look. Looks like they were in the kitchen. Uh, okay, so you... Great. Now I have to look at the flash drive from things. Of course, you know, because why would anybody just respect your personal belongings? Welcome to the real 
Alright, what's going on? No. What'd she do? gonna do Watson too. Hey Juliet. You're gonna be here Of course I do. Uh, of course I do. <laughs> Thanks. I love Dana in because she was sexing Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would Dana do that? Would Dana do that? Victoria, Daniel would do anything to date Victoria. According to Victoria, hmm. she saw the sex, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go straight to hell. I'm not going around until she tells the truth. Okay, okay so what am I gonna do? Victoria's room, man. Oh, look at that. What is that on the wall? That is not art. I'm sorry. Is that TV? Of course, you got a huge TV. Should steal your cashmere and smear it. It's a camera. Oh, tablet. Is she going to be a crazy friend of her for the long run? Maybe I will join her costume. Yeah, really. Jeez, $3,600. Victoria, and who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Boom! This is the email I never showed you yet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Okay, how do I print it? How do I print it? Boom! This is the email I never showed you yet. Now I have to print this fast. That's so nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a fixer? Okay, how do I... How do I print it? There's a printer right there, but I can't print anything. Oh, print email. Wait, where was it? I guess I was over... Oh, here it is. Take it. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. It ho hopefully should. Victoria is just troublesome. I she's the girl that, you know, nobody should like. Hipster nerd. I mean, I'm not wrong. If I have to stand there, it's gonna take me forever to get there. Can 
talk to you? No. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha. your last one. Sure. Whatever you say, Victoria. Alright, let's go to the parking lot. So don't think I'm lying. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. Let's intervene. I hate that dude. Detective douche. Excuse us. This is official campus business. I hope so. Oh, these headphones are terrible. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime. I'm so nice. Okay. I felt like an everyday hero. Oh, I felt like an everyday hero. Oops. Guess I shouldn't have skipped that, huh? Peaceful music. I don't remember how long these chapters are. I'm glad I said that in that time. I can't stand to see people being bored. Neither can I. Message, message, don't bully. Step it, step up. Make sure, you know, stop bullying. He's a brave. What up, Max? Who are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. Cold shoulder. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. I don't remember the driver. There's only a new bird six miles away. Just. Definitely. No worries, Martin. I took a sweet shot of Victoria. I can't believe the shit. Oh, it's score one for Team Max. Payback. It'd be so hard to see her ass pound face all over the airwaves. I guess she does deserve it for all the shitty things she's done to people in here. Definitely. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie video on my flash drive? Yeah, sure. Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from the here at the Twilight Zone, which seems after for the day. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than the food. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. No way! No fucking way would I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. And I laugh my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful when you say it. How so? How so? Since you usually lose, they'll be having sex with you. Oh god. You need a sensitive woman to kick your ass. If I was lucky. Speaking of it and bash, you should come down to my party and actually move this week. But you seem distracted. Uh I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. You probably are. I'm a good listener. Who is one? This is between you and me, not social media. I'm insulting. Yes. I had this incredibly bizarre experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life changing. I would say. Jefferson's photo movies. I'm one of the students. What the fuck ever? 
I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal now. Answer me, bitch. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. Yeah, you. You told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. They try. You should talk to somebody with him. Do not analyze me! I paid you for this. Worry about yourself in this country. I could call the police. I could call the police. Do it! Well, that's because all the police here. Get away from her, dude! Ow! Hey! Leave me alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, not that. or that whore in the bathroom! <gasps> yes! Scratch him. Is that Elvis? I think that's Elvis. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up. And dangerous. This day in the Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years of slow mess, huh, Don't give it a guilty face. Just pretend you're about to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. No, you're not. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing. Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another arcade asshole. Your friend wants to beat down for you. Why? Yeah, I owe him a big time. You're not the only one, Beth. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? Pretty much. Yeah, a little bit. I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of joined out of the league. I would think you'd fit right in with our school hipsters. But you look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still smart ass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Black Little Academy. Only for Mark Jefferson. Only for Mark Jefferson. He was a pretty famous photographer in the 90s. I've always loved his work. Those that can't do, teach. I'm glad to find a good reason to come back. Don't you think you're happy to see me? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh, give me a break. Give me a break. I was going through changes. Like you. I guess those changes have been a dumping me from your life. Yeah. And that's not true, Chloe. Bullshit. You thought you'd end up with all these art pricks in Seattle. You have enough. You're merciless. You've been at Black Row for almost a month without letting you know. I just wanted to sit on first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. That'll never happen. I told you you were a Probably not. But you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me. Super cereal. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. Best if douche has a boatload of tools. They didn't even visit my place. Maybe very specific kind of tools. You heard of hers? My stepdad has a fully stock garage. And he actually is a fully tool. Welcome home, ass. Hey, thanks. That license plate said twerks. The house still looks nice. Oh shit. Hey, I'd like to have a house like that. Come on now. different than the last 
time you saw it. It's cool. At least you can shut out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. I step here to make sure of that. I'm gonna close the door. Put on some music while I'm meditating. Sure. Let, let's just. CD. Hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. No, you, you were trying to be. <laughs> they were lovers. We all have that friend. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole, you didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. The world doesn't have a bomb. You were back at a different era. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a man. That was a plan. Okay. Get the hell out of Bigfoot Hill into Los Angeles. I can see why. I can see why. I bet your mom is not too She is happy enough to marry an Elsie. Reason number 356 to escape. I'm afraid of the world. Well, when did Rachel actually disappear? Forty years ago. Six months ago. I was close. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. What about her parents? What about her parents? Are they looking for her? They're in denial. Max, I know she's missing. I assume you know more. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody and changed her life. And poof. And I haven't heard anything from her since. Look okay, everybody you know. My dad, you, and Rachel. Um, can you put on some music now? It's a rough life. Nothing but junk in this suitcase. Uh, yeah, a little bit. Chloe was always taller than me. He made a dad to try to forget. Oh, at the top it says that is gone. That's sad. Chloe totally changed her style. I barely recognized her. Oh, this is a flashback to Our super secret closet lair. And it looks like the room. Gross. Sweet. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you can't do any change on that. Actually, look at the snow globe. Wow, three thousand six dollars. That's a lot of money. Look at that. Chloe and her dad are so close. That's gotta be rough. I don't know anymore. Too pretentious. I used to have a radio like that. It's at my room. Let's plug the CD in. It's 
go to the garage. Okay. Come on. Oh, nice spike on the game. There we go. Wait, what? Uh, you round always. I'm gonna get the tea later today. Sure. Okay, so we're getting tea with Kate. First time they drank beer. Beer. Hello, laptop. Search. Probably not. That's crazy. Let's just close that. We're, we're not gonna leave anything unturned. Switch on, switch off, open. Pretty paranoid, apparently. This is so lame. Very lame. Or something. Ah, uh, it's not where I wanted to go. Oh boy. Final notice, that's never good. We've all been there. Something like that. Corned beef and hash, yeah. More food. This dude is crazy. Shit! Butter Yep, gotta rewind. Creeper, like really. Alright, let's. Re <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, 
Let's just find the tools. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Yeah, I can't unlock it. Okay. Where are the tools then? Ooh, Up there. Precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. That was very smart, Dominus. What can you reach? Okay. I should have done that before though. Probably. Oh, okay. Okay, I got this. And they fall. And now we pull it off. Yeah, Max. Maximilian. Maxine, I'm guessing. Female. Let's head back up to Chloe. See what she's doing. Can I close the door? No. Go upstairs. Let's see what Chloe is getting into. I won't snoop around too much. That's not right. Don't snoop around other people's house. That's the bathroom. I'm snooping. There we go. Wrong way. Well, it was the right way anyway. Okay, desk. Tools. Pretty good if she knows how to fix her own camera. Most people don't know how to do that. I mean, let's just do this, that'll work. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these in the photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Booyah, you skank. I was a bitch. Yep. That's very good, too. Thank you. Uh, no way. Where did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? Yeah. In the bathroom today. You set up the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. Yep. It totally makes sense. Definitely. You have to save my life. For sure. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there. I was there. I knew. Damn. You were a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly. Different so time, badass. different types of ninjas. Oh, no. I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? Nope. Margo, your hair and clothes are so different. I hope so. I'm sure this is all so weird to you after coming back. A little bit. Like you said, it's been that kind of thing. Definitely. So you must have overheard our conversation. Sort of. Just a tidbit. Just a bit. There's no way you didn't hear every single vowel. No, oh, you'd be surprised. Absolutely. Yo, mama. Yes. Too late. Sure. This was my real box camera. I want you to have it. 
Or should we take the picture? I guess we, we gotta take the picture. We can't dance. I don't see Max as being a dancer. But that's just me. No, I cannot. You spelled rock wrong. Oh god, that's so, that's so awkward. Just leave all my other pictures there. Very peaceful, very quiet. Right. Oh dear. It's a durable. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Probably because you were just here. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare state. 
Yeah. Deja vu. Man, that's crazy. Lighthouse. I really don't need to look closer at that. That's the lighthouse sign. Warren. Now what? Equals kick. Kick! We're just so lucky. We can always escape. Campfire. Sure. Betcha she comes up here a lot. Take that big show. I'm already sitting. Are you pissed at me? I just wanted some backup. I'm sorry. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. Okay. I'm sorry you had to experience it first hand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Probably. Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted him. He's paranoid. He freaked out on Fort Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other black girls students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's a war or something. PTSD. How's he hide them? What's Nathan's secrets? What's Nathan's secret? He's a lead asshole who sells bad shit from Glassif. Glassif? What? The way he was in Shibble Bowl and didn't call me. He was too rich for the place and too racy. Flashing things. Just tell me what happened to him. Yeah. That was a leak. But he was so blazed it would be in his school. You think he could only that bad? Actually, yes. I had a good time. But I thought I had enough for me to make sure that she should not. How much? How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. And before I could get a chunk of that for Nathan, he goes to my drink for some shit. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? When I passed out on the floor, I woke up and I put the smiling one told me that came out. Oh my. Nathan was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and bucked him up. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get him out. Nice. Oh, that'd be bad. I'm so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So then, back to him. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. Call the police. What are you going to do? Pop a cat in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. You already told the principal I'm sure it's useless. I won't always be here to save him. You and your dumb mess. Safety? I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like destiny. Best friend. Destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I'm Best friend, I would expect you would. The shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. Well, I'm Did back. Bomb our Katie Bay and turned to fucking boss. Headache. Again. Why is this happening to me? Because you're
you're insane and you're crazy because you have a migraine oh dear <laughs> gotta be careful not to lose things that are dear to you ow Stay up there. Ow. Hit me in the back of the leg, really? It's a nice deer. It's a little see-through. you were gone for five years, so a lot can change. Smack. Newspaper. What do you say? Or something. Oh yeah. This is a video game. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. Chloe might be a little cold. It's like 80 degrees. Apparently not. Climate change. More storms coming. Max, start from the beginning. I just did? What more do you want me to tell you? I just told you everything. I can reverse that. I saved your life. I bet you that's the window we snuck out. She's crying. Did I stand her up? I said I'd get tea with her at 4 a.m. Did I stand her up? Prescott's bad news. What are 
That's blurry. Oh. Uh, Rachel. So there's a lot more story to that. I don't remember any of that right there. So that's the end of the first episode. Okay. So that was good. I like that. Uh, it's my first time actually playing with it. Playing with it. Playing Life is Strange here. It was actually really good. Um, I like these story-based games. You know, I, uh, all for the first-person shooters and everything. But the story-based games here, they're... They hold more to them in a smaller area. You know, I, I grew up playing the story-based games before online was even a thing. So I, I really like this. Now, graphics, a little off, but you know, it's still good. Still good. I like the look of it all. I'm interested to see what happens here a little later, though. Uh, I mainly remember, like, the beginning and the, how it ends. I don't remember anything in the middle, so some of that stuff was new to me. So, yeah, that was, that was pretty good. Uh, how long have we been recording? About an hour, hour and a half. So, uh, I probably could cut some of the stuff out, uh, some of the more boring stuff. Expect, you know, about a chapter a day for the next week or so. Hopefully getting uh, the second Life is Strange here quite soon. I don't know if there's anything more. No, oh, okay. I stayed hidden. Okay. I reported Nathan, who wouldn't. I made fun of Victoria. Well, duh. Helped Kate. Okay. I didn't know someone could draw my portrait. I didn't know someone was having a petition. I mean, I I would have left it at her getting smacked in the head with the uh, football, but you know, uh, I didn't even even see Kate Slade. I guess I should watch more. I watered my plant, duh. Dana had a pregnancy test. I didn't even know. I could have reorganized her photos. I wish. Uh, wow, I've really missed a lot of stuff. Oh, a bird died! I didn't even know! Oh, jeez. Okay. I read David's files. Of course I would read. Who wouldn't? Okay. Ow. Well, that's not good. Yeah, that might hurt a little. Alright, so chapter 2 is out of time. I expect that to pop up here tomorrow. Uh, this is really fun. I'm having a lot of fun with this. Um, I should take a little bit more time here. Uh, I seem to be missing a lot of stuff. Which, I, I didn't know there was so much side story to it to begin with. So, thank you guys for watching. Uh, you know, at the end of all my videos starting today, I'm going to uh, quote my quote of the week. And the quote of the week today is, it costs zero dollars to say hello. Sometimes that's all somebody needs between life and death situation. Uh, you know, someone taking their own life. It costs zero dollars to say hello to somebody. So, make sure you go find someone who you can say hello to. You know, you could change somebody's life. You could save somebody's life. But thank you guys so much for watching, uh, and I will see everybody later.